What's up guys and welcome to Vlogmas Day 4. so lit on Fridays because I'm off. I know it's just two days off, but it feels like a vacation to me every time I leave that job. <laughs> but right now, I'm headed home. But first, if you guys have been following me for a long time, then y'all already know what I'm about to say. Your girl stay in Kroger. Like, I just went to Kroger yesterday. I'm going back to Kroger today. And the reason being is because those enchiladas was hitting last night. If you was thinking about, oh, I'm going to wait for sis to tell me how they are before I make it, go ahead and make it, sis. Like, they were hitting. Now, granted, you know, they diet um enchiladas because the different like definitely if i was making this and it wasn't like any calorie restriction i would definitely you know choose a different tortilla and a different cheese but for what i had to use it was great you know what i'm saying so anyway guys yeah so those were really really good and i do have some that i'm gonna eat today but i want to amp it up and i want to like make it like a whole like mexican night well not necessarily like mexican night but i'm going to add chips to it and i'm gonna get some salsa so i found a recipe on pinterest on how to make homemade chips using wonton wrappers so i'm about to go to the store pick those up and also get some salsa because i don't think we have any look me saying that just like I did yesterday with that um mirror pole blend and I get home and we got a whole freezer full of all different kind of seasoning blends and I actually do like that pig sweet seasoning blend the Cajun mirror pole one is really really good and it's definitely good if you're using like 90% or 99% lean ground turkey it just really flavors it up because it's like Cajun so it adds a little spice to it um but since I was using 85 and we already had that one open I was like I ain't gonna open one just to use it and it turned out really really good but yeah so your girl about to go to Kroger get everything I need to make these homemade chips and I'm like craving chips anyway so this is the best thing to do so I won't go off the deep end because yes I do have a ton of weeklies but I will be using my weeklies tomorrow because it's Saturday me and mama gonna be out and about um so yeah I'm definitely gonna use um, some of my weeklies tomorrow so I'm gonna do the right thing and make some healthy chips today so stay tuned to whenever I get home so you guys can see that but y'all work was pretty good today like um we weren't busy it is slowing down uh texas is well my area has went down to 50 percent capacity for stuff because we have been over 15 percent of corona patients in the hospitals for seven days so they did put a cap like they closing bars down restaurants and hair salons and all that stuff all that stuff got to go back down to 50 percent but to be truthfully honest i don't even think the people never went down again because like corona is real y'all like it is real that's why i try to promote like wear your mask use your sanitizers wash your hands like you know stuff that you you're supposed to already do <laughs> as far as like that washing of the hands and stuff but yes guys so um it's been kind of just like slow like most of our hospitals are filled with corona patients and um they have cut off the elective surgeries because they said they don't have time for somebody to be up in there recovering and we got corona patients around which is like so crazy that they can be like hey you we're not gonna have so i mean we're not gonna let you have surgery because you're gonna need to stay in the hospital to recover but we got a pandemic going on and we need this bed like it is so crazy but i mean it's real life and it's realistic and we gotta start taking it serious in order for it to go away you know and i'm so sorry about the sun y'all like it, it's giving me life um but yeah, so because of that, work has been kind of slow or whatever. And also, today is candle day. Like, this is the first day. I did order online, y'all. Like, I did me an order because they have some online exclusives that you can only get online, of course. So I wanted to get a couple of those. Not all of them because most of those candles are not my thing. And I'm I'm the person that, like, I like spending money. And I like um, buying candles from Bath & Body Works. It's important. But also, I don't have time to um be just getting sense that i know i'm not gonna like and i'm i don't want to return anything i don't want to have to go through all this so yeah some of those online exclusives was just not my jam like it, it makes me think your house is gonna smell like grass and and, and forest and I, I just don't want that um i'm so sorry about the light y'all but yeah so anyway today was candle day but unfortunately if you did not get your candles earlier they are now officially sold out online so now you can only go to the store which today was the only day you can be online anyway 
so you do have to go to the store on Saturday and Sunday. So me and mama have a plan tomorrow. We're gonna go to Bath and Body Works, get the rest of the candles that I need, because I only bought 12 online, because like I said, it was really more about the online exclusives for me. So yeah, that's why I even bought some stuff online. So yeah, we're gonna go to Bath and Body Works first, and then I need to go to Hobby Lobby or Michaels, whichever one, to get the rest of the decor for us to do the Christmas tree. So you, um, you guys, like, I can't wait to get that done so I can actually do like the official tour, and y'all can see everything, like, you know, with the lights on and how everything looks. And then we're gonna go to the container store because my mom says she needs something, some storage for her spare bedroom, and I need storage for the kitchen and pantry because for one we got so many pots and pans now and then the pantry like it, it's cute like it can be so much cuter though so we're gonna go to the container store as well and then after that um me and my mama gonna probably just pick up some lunch that's why i said i'm not really sure what we're gonna eat i know baby gonna want you know to eat something good tomorrow for dinner um so yeah i'll be using my weeklies and stuff tomorrow but yeah me and my mama have like a full day plan i'm really trying to hit everything on just this day so we can limit having to go to these stores every day so yeah, I do want to just like at least find everything that I need for Christmas decor because I mean Christmas is legit in what two and a half three weeks So it ain't even like I could just be shopping every other day for Christmas because Christmas is about to be here and be gone So fingers crossed that I find everything that I need. I'm really not looking for much more Like I said, I really am just trying to keep it simple this year um, and I'm loving the quarter that I have so much, but of course, like I said, I gotta finish out the tree and do a couple of more pieces in the living area. So I'm excited about that. I'm excited about just spending time because me and my mama, we really haven't been seeing each other that much because we take we've been taking social distancing serious. So I don't even get to see her as much as I used to. Um, so it's gonna be good for us to like get out tomorrow because last time me and my mama went somewhere, oh my god, that was when we went to IKEA and that was like months ago, at least three months ago at least three months ago so it's been a while and those of you who like the um my mama in the vlogs you'll definitely see her tomorrow so stay tuned and i'll also be doing a tour of her house so you guys can see how we did her christmas decorations because i gave her all of my decorations from last year so she has them at her house and i went over on thanksgiving and we uh decorated and everything so i'm excited about all of that okay hold on why is there traffic i don't want traffic on a friday and i'm the toll road like i hate that i have that when there's traffic on the toll road because we pay to be on this road so i just feel like we ain't supposed to have no traffic <laughs> but anyway guys i'm gonna go ahead and stop flapping my mouth because you know how i can get and i will pick you guys up when we get the kroger so we can get these ingredients so when i get home i can make these chips i know they're gonna be good like i was just reading reviews on like the pinterest like people leave comments on the recipes and stuff and everybody was just like man i won't even buy store-bought chips no more and i ain't gonna even go that far to say it. y'all know how it is i ain't gonna go to for to go that far to say that but i am excited to have just like a healthier type of chip that i can enjoy with some salsa as an appetizer tonight before your girl go in on her enchiladas and her refried beans because yeah we gonna run that back one more again <laughs> but i'll pick you guys up when i make it to kroger I went in Kroger they don't even sell they didn't even have egg roll wraps they didn't have anything so there's a Walmart that's up the street from here so I'm gonna go there because I know for sure they'll have it so I'm gonna go ahead and go to Walmart normally I will feel defeated and go on about my business but I really do want to taste these damn homemade chips so Walmart here we go <laughs>
home, so I had success at Walmart. For one, y'all, I went to one of the ghetto Walmarts. Ooh, never again will I go in there. Like, it was so ghetto, I forgot the salsa, but that's okay, because we have some. They didn't even have any of my clear American water. Like, legit, they didn't even have any. But I did just pick up two of those. I also picked up the Extreme Wellness. These were the ones I used for the enchiladas. And since I used it yesterday, I like to keep them on hand, just in case I ever crave quesadillas, tacos, or anything, because these are one point on Weight Watchers. So, yeah, I like to keep these on hand y'all also saw me pick these up because me and baby discovered these on thanksgiving y'all and they was litty so this is definitely for sunday for cheat day just bake these put a little butter on them mm -hmm. and then lastly i did find the wonton wrapper so i'm excited i'm about to get ready and make the chips but i also pick up the egg roll egg roll wraps because i found a recipe too to make like um piece of egg rolls or just anything with it in the air fryer and i told you guys i want to start like using the air fryer which i'm gonna make these in the oven today but you can make them in the air fryer as well but i'm gonna make them in the oven today but yeah so i went on ahead and picked these up since i saw them so i can do the recipe for that as well so this is what i went for and I did get it, so I'm not upset about it. But yeah, let's go ahead and get these chips in the oven. Okay, guys, for this recipe, you don't need much. All you need is your one tone wraps, some salt, and some canola oil spray, vegetable spray. If you want to use regular oil, you can, whichever you want to do. So that way your salt can stick to your one tone to make, you know, like a salted chip, like a tortilla chip. Then use that. And then you just need a cookie sheet that's lined with parchment paper so it won't stick. Like, this is all you need. So yeah, let's go ahead and make. Slay bells ring, diamonds bling, carol sing, favorite season. Slay bells ring, diamonds bling, carol sing, favorite season. Catch me rolling, I'm the chosen, snow is falling. So the chips are in the oven and hopefully they turn out well because I really want to try them. I'm about to get ready and break my fast. If y'all been following me, even just right now, y'all already know what the play is. I'm going to take my Nutriburst. This is my liquid multivitamin. And then I make my smoothies in the morning. So I'm going to go ahead and have my smoothie. And this is what breaks my fast. Um, and so far, I have been fasting for 21 hours and 49 minutes. So, so yes, yes, it is definitely time for your girl to break her fast. I am ready for today on fridays it's like my body knows like the weekend is coming so on fridays it's kind of like a hard day for me to like finish my water and you know fast all day but i got it done i am finished with my gallon of water where i have a little bit left in my cup and that will be my gallon and yeah we got it done because like i said in wednesday's video i don't know what's wrong with me this week but like i really have been trying to talk myself out of being on my journey but the good thing is i was all talk i still remained faithful to everything thing y'all see i've been doing my fast and stuff all week it's just like i don't know what was wrong with me this week oh good news right after i hung up the vlog with y'all last night taylor um put on her story that my wig was ready so your girl has a hair appointment tuesday at 4 30 and i am ready like i said i do love my natural hair i love the curls and stuff like that but i'm a weave wearer I always have been always will be so i'm excited <laughs> baby laughing so i'm excited to go ahead and get my wig slayed y'all she finna leave and go to get her some Popeyes. That's all right though. Cause Sunday, I want everything I hear about. <laughs> Y'all know that commercial? <laughs> mm. That's the halfway point, so I need to go turn the chips around. So I'm gonna turn them and then I'll be right back. Okay, yeah, so I turned them over so far, so good. Like they look like they turned into little chips or whatever. I'm excited. Like I told you, baby had left, so she finna go to Popeyes and get her dinner. She gotta work tonight and she actually worked tomorrow night too. So uh she she says she always saw her cheat days on Friday. So Friday, Saturday, Sunday, she be turned up. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna stay true to it. Go ahead and have my smoothie right now. I'm gonna come back and show you guys what the chips are looking like. It only takes about 10 minutes minutes it just depended on like i put it on 350 some people say five minutes some people say 10 minutes but i want these to be like crispy so um i'm gonna see what it look like at the 10 minute
minutes and if i need to go like five minutes longer i will but yeah when i come back i will show you guys what these are looking like Alrighty guys, so here's what the chips look like. I did let mine go a little longer because like I told you guys, I really like a crispier chip. So that's why it's like a darker color, but you can have them be a little light skin. But I do like mine like this. And then they just say, let them sit and cool down. And then, you know, hopefully they had a crunch that I wanted, everything. But yeah, I am impressed that that one time made like this chip like omg <laughs> i am really impressed but yeah i'm definitely gonna have this with some salsa and this is gonna be my appetizer before i dig into my enchiladas that i had yesterday Alrighty, guys so they cooled down a bit and this is what it is looking like like it looks like a real chip i mean like it has the texture of a tortilla chip and everything so i was like what's the point of making these if i ain't gonna try it on camera for y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and try let you know how i I like it like again i used the canola spray oil and then i did sprinkle some salt on here so that's the only thing that's on here but i saw people putting like parmesan to make like parmesan cheese crisp or i saw other people putting other different kind of herbs like garlic salt garlic powder all that kind of stuff but i just wanted some plain ones so let me try it <gasps> like it crunch <sighs> okay okay so it's definitely not a chip, but it's a chip. You know what I'm saying? Well, I think I have to take that back. Because it's not that it don't taste like a tortilla chip, because it definitely tastes like a chip. It's just that in my mind, I guess I'm telling myself it's not. Yeah, I made chips. Like I legit made chips. I'm gonna get some sauce and I'm gonna try this right now, hold on. All right guys, so I got some picante sauce. This is the hot kind. This is only one point on Weight Watchers um, cause it's really just vegetables. So I'm just gonna pour a little in here, just this much, that'll be enough to get through all these. Cause I used four, I mean I used eight wonton wrappers and it's two points for four. So it's only four points for these chips y'all, four points. And then one point for the salsa. So five points. It's a cool snack. So this is the chip I had. Like it even hold up well with the salsa. Like can y'all see? Oh my God. Okay. Mmm. That salsa hot. But y'all. Okay then. Okay then. So I'm definitely going to have chips and salsa before I have my enchiladas. And then that way that'll give me actually the points that I needed. Because remember, I wasn't, um, I was losing three points. But with this, I'm actually, I'm not losing any points. So I'm excited. I hope you guys try this. If you do, let me know. Again, I found this on Pinterest. I found most of my recipes on Pinterest are either from the WW Pound Dropper. And she has a lot of recipes I looked up today. So don't, so don't worry. worry. It'll be a lot more recipe videos that are coming up for Vlogmas. So yeah, I'll come back so baby can say what she needs to say to y'all. And then we'll go ahead and end the vlog for today. Alrighty guys, so baby is back. And I had made the chip presentation look so good. Look, this is how I did her. So she is going to try them and let me know what she thinks. So I'm going to give you one. Um, I'm coming around so I can do it. Okay, well, I want you to try the chip first by itself. So she's going to try to let me know. Dog, she went right in. This one tastes like a cheese it A cheese it It ain't even got no cheese on it. That's how cheese tastes to me. No cheese at all. That's why I don't let her try none of y'all because she don't okay. she don't taste it for what it is. She got to think about what it look like. No, nah, it's good. Like, do, I, like I, when I first took a bite, I was like, it don't taste like a chip. But then, like, as I chewed, I was like, it's a chip. Look, look at baby's face. Like, it tastes like a chip, right? Uh-oh, she dipped again, y'all. That means it's good. You need that cheese. What cheese? That queso stuff. Oh, yeah, it'll be good with some queso, too. Hmm. Okay. No. Oh, these not mine. Yeah, I got can it. make you some. It only take 10 minutes. 10 minutes, that's it, y'all. You can have another one, though, because I still got my intro and stuff. You know I can't eat all this. Oh, she got another one. That makes me feel good. That means she like it because baby don't eat nothing she don't like. <laughs> and they crunchy. And they crunchy. That's why I did it's let them go a little salty. longer. It's not salty. Because I just sprinkled salt. I it's didn't. a good consistent. My baby didn't came up. My baby making stuff. Y'all don't know how hard. <laughs> I tried to get her to believe in her that she can really cook. Yes, but I just follow recipes off of Pinterest. Oh, my God. I'm glad she like it, y'all. 
Okay, well that is, hey, you better try them. That's the winner. <laughs> so excited. Up. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I just sent my mama a picture. She was like, what you make that out of? Can you bring me some? <laughs> and my mama is a chip. Like, she the one, the reason I eat tortilla chips, like, they're like, at the bag, honey. Like, we, I really don't even need no dip. I just wanted to do that, you know, from a little Mexican thing with my enchiladas. Yeah, yeah, we will be able to have something. A home, you know, a housewoman, we ain't gonna have a housewoman party until our second year, right? Right. But that'll be good for a party with some of that uh, jalapeno cheese dip on the side that of That make me feel good. You ain't never gotta worry about, what's their name? Chipotle for getting your chips again. Yes, because Chipotle my forgot my chips the last two times I went. Well, the one time they forgot and the second time they didn't have I'm any. Not uh oh, you can have another one. Oh, she want another one. Okay, anyway. But yes, okay, so baby <laughs> like the chips. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end that the vlog for tonight because nothing else is gonna happen. Like I said, we about to eat and then baby's going to work and I need to edit so I can get this up for you guys. So nothing else is gonna happen tonight, but stay tuned to tomorrow because uh, uh we're gonna do some shopping. Like I already been shopping. I got something to show y'all. Like I done bought leggings, I done bought a robe from Victoria's Secret, I done bought stuff from Fenty Skin. Like I got some stuff to show y'all. But I'll show y'all that tomorrow. What you gotta say for the vlog, my love? I'm enjoying y'all for this vlog. Oh, uh, she really is, cause she was like, let me say something to the vlog. She, she won't let me say. say I know she be here censoring me. You should start putting the censor button right there when you don't want me to say what I want to say. <laughs> she been censoring I told everybody in the now. comments, Ross employees not finna fight us. They not finna beat us up. Oh, just let me say this one thing about okay. her. Go there on Tuesdays. This is the day to get a trip. That's all I'ma say. Okay. That's how you say. Yes, get, go to, go on Tuesdays. They got new shipment stuff coming in. You know, going out. <laughs> roll back, roll back. <laughs> She's so silly. But anyway, guys, we love you. Not this is your time to what? Thumbs up, like the video, subscribe, subscribe, and turn your notification bell on to be notified when we post the next video. And we're gonna see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm gonna spend a lot of money, y'all. So don't tell. I'm gonna be asleep, so I ain't gonna know. But don't tell. But when I wake up, cause I'm gonna spend all this money. <laughs>